What's up YouTube? I'm back with another video. Today's video we are going to be talking about having boundaries with family, okay? And, and friends, okay? But yeah, having boundaries with family, friends, relatives, whatever you want to call it. So the reason why I'm making this video is quite personal and I don't usually share a lot of you know what I mean? but I'm gonna go ahead and do this video anyway. I have grown to be very tired of the overstepping of boundaries with my family and with some friends in the past. Now I have good friends, but friends in the past, I'll explain. I am a great person. I know I am a great person. I'm not bragging about it, but when you know, you know, and you say it. I'm a good person. I will go out of my way to do for people. Sometimes I even go out of my way for people that I don't even know. Like, I will go out of my way and give to a homeless person or over tip at a restaurant or over tip at places that don't even do tips like I'm just that type of person I'm a really good and kind soul okay sometimes your family and your friends will take advantage of you because they see that you are so kind and that you are so giving does that mean you should let them Probably not. It is not going to be easy to set these boundaries. You know, it is not always going to be easy to say no right away, especially if you do not know how to say no. I am going to help you and I'm going to give you some advice. When you feel like you have family or friends or relatives or whoever the case may be that are constantly overstepping boundaries, constantly asking for things, constantly using you, I'm going to show you how to deal with that. You need to say, no, I don't have it. If I that one, no, I don't have it. And it's as simple as that. You need to say, no, I don't have it. And if they love you and if they care about you so much, they will understand. They will understand that you said no for whatever reason that you said no for. And if they just so happen to get an attitude with you because you said no, you probably shouldn't be talking to that family member or friend on a regular basis, okay? You hit them up when you have time. You answer their calls when you want to answer their calls. If they're constantly asking for something, and they don't even ask you how you've been, how your day is going, how, how your life is, you need to stay away from that person. You need to make sure you set some boundaries where you are not constantly subjected to that person's behavior because that is not okay. You deserve friends that are not always gonna ask you for stuff. You deserve family members that are not always asking you for stuff. There are family members that are really understanding and kind. There are friends and people that are really understanding and kind so i don't want you guys to feel like because these are your relatives and this is your long time home girl or homeboy that you're supposed to just you know dig in your pocket whenever you have something like no create boundaries create boundaries okay answer when you want to answer pick up the phone when you want to pick up the phone text back when you want to text back it is your money it is your time that you're giving out you get to control that you don't have to do anything that you don't want want to do okay stop being gaslighted stop being pressured stop being guilt tripped you know i know there's a lot of moms or dads that might guilt trip you and say oh but i raised you i did all of this for you you're not doing anything for me how could you i brought you on this earth yeah well <laughs> you didn't necessarily choose to like be brought on this earth so that's not your fault that's their fault for having you create some boundaries and say directly i would love to but i just don't have it and let them walk away. Let them be upset. Let them tell so and so that you told them no. That's not your problem anymore. No, you've done you've done your work, honey. Now you need to just go be free, go do what you want, and keep your money and keep your assets or whatever you want in your pocket. These family members and friends are not entitled to anything you have. It is all up to you to give to your family when you want to, or to buy them something when you want to buy them something. You are not obligated to do anything for your family or your friends. That wraps up this video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure to comment down below, hit the notification bell if you wanna see a video every time I make it. And yeah, I will catch you guys later. Bye.